Hey everyone, and welcome back to our channel. I'm Kyle, and today we're gonna figure out which World Cup Adidas ball is right for you. Before we hop into the video, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to be the first to know when we upload a new video. At the heart of every World Cup match is a specially designed ball inspired by the host country. But if you wanna kick around with the same ball the pros will be playing with at the World Cup, it's going to cost you $165. And if that seems to be too much of a price tag, then you are in luck, because I'm going to break down each version of the 2022 World Cup ball so you can grab the best one for you, hopefully at soccer.com. The 2022 Adidas World Cup ball comes in six different versions, but I'll focus a bit more on the top three before talking about the more training-oriented versions. First, we have the Pro. Coming in at $165, this ball is what will be used during play in Qatar. Technically, it does come in two different color styles, the one we have here, and then an orange version in case it snows, because that's probably gonna happen. But aside from color, this top level ball has a solid textured PU surface with thermal bonded panels for the ultimate speed and accuracy during flight. Another surface feature only found in the Pro is the diamond micro texture imprinted on the ball. This makes a noticeable difference in touch and control. Moving inward, the Pro also features a bladder combining CTR core technology and high grade synthetic rubber for the best air retention and the most accurate rebound you're gonna find in a ball. Making a dramatic jump down to $60, we also have the competition ball. While boasting many of the features of the Pro, the competition does have some subtle differences that allow for the lower price point. The first and most noticeable difference is the texture on the surface of the ball. The competition has a slightly less detailed texture called Micro Prisma, which still provides an elite level of control and touch, just not quite like the Pro Ball. The second and more hidden difference is that the internal bladder of the competition is technically patched rather than Adidas using the CTR core technology found in the Pro. With these differences, the competition ball still offers great performance, but for those on a smaller budget. Next is the league version at $40. Once again, at first glance, you won't notice much of a difference. However, the texture on the league ball is even more subtle compared to the competition ball. Beyond that, the ball only differs from the competition in quality of materials rather than the materials themselves. For instance, the bladder is made of a lower grade synthetic rubber and the surface material is TPU rather than the more true PU of the competition and pro balls. With all that being said, the league ball still gets FIFA quality approval and is great for training and match day. Finally, I'll address the remaining three versions all together. Here I have the training ball for $30, the club ball for 20 bucks, and the mini coming in at a whopping $14. The training and club balls are great for players still maturing through the lower age groups as they both come in sizes three, four, and five. Additionally, the club ball has six different color styles, so the player has more freedom in personalizing their ball. Last but not least, the mini is great for technical training, honing your skills, or simply as a gift for that one player who still can't resist a little 1v1 in the kitchen or living room. So there you have it, every version of the World Cup ball for this winter in Qatar. Hopefully this guide helped you out in deciding which ball might be right for you. And if you got anything to add to the conversation, drop it down there in the comments. And if you did find this video helpful, make sure to give this video a like, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell icon so you're notified every time we upload new content. That is all from us here at Soccer.com. Get out there, play some footy if you can, and we'll see you in the next video.